Bologna, also called Bologna La Rossa, a city famous for its heritage, miles of porticos, and delectable ragu alla bolognese. But we're not here in Italy for La Dolce Vita. A few kilometers away from the red city, you can find another famous red, the most famous red car company in the world. The Ferrari Challenge is a remarkable racing series that brings together passionate Ferrari owners and enthusiasts from all over the globe. It's a thrilling spectacle that showcases the raw power, precision and elegance that defines the Ferrari brand. A series designed for those whose passion runs as deep as iconic red hues. The Ferrari Challenge is split across four regions, Europe, North America, UK and Japan and offers drivers the thrills of high-end professional racing on some of the most picturesque tracks in the world. Once drivers qualify, each has the opportunity to compete across one of four categories to best match their skill level and experience. Alongside this gorgeous Ferrari 488 Challenge Evo, I'm joined by Andrea Bertolini, a long-term factory driver, seasoned racing driver, a renowned coach, and a passionate advocate for the art of performance driving. What does it mean to be a, a factory driver? What's your, your role? Basically just to drive all the cars? <laughs> uh, no, with the Ferrari, you know, I drive uh, in the championship, with the GT championship, with the Ferrari. I made all the shakedown of the Formula One. For people who don't know what a, what a shakedown is, what, is, what does it mean to, to do a shakedown? You know, we have Formula One client, they had the event all around the world. They have to replace the engine, the gearbox. Uh, I have to, to test again the car after the guys let me change uh, something in the car. So all the cars downstairs? Uh, oh, many, many. For this reason, uh, I am super lucky. Today, I did already 538 shakedown of the oh, all, all different. And thanks really to to the simulation, to ANSYS. If you consider that in the past, when we started 20 years, 25 years ago, the, the total time to be ready was almost uh, two and a half years, thanks to the simulation. In one year, we are ready. And also the quality of the development is 10 times better than in the past. Because now we go on track with just the best thing that we select in the simulation. A high performance machine developed in only one year. That is awesome. But let's dig a little bit deeper into how simulation is helping Ferrari meet these development goals. Um, I want to talk about the Ferrari Challenge yeah. and how the 5G antenna plays a role in that. Uh, Ferrari Challenge è sempre stato un campionato molto innovativo e per questo noi cerchiamo sempre delle, soluzio delle soluzioni che rendano speciali la, la guida per i nostri piloti. Eh, per questo eh, noi eh, sfruttiamo molto le tecnologie di simulazione che ci offre ANSYS per, eh, soprattutto l'antenna 5G perché permette la comunicazione fra pilota e eh, l'ingegnere che sta al box e quindi prendere anche delle eh, decisioni in tempo rapido che sono fondamentali nel, nel corso della gara. Tell me about some of the key uh, engineering challenges that you're solving with the ANSYS simulation. Le simulazioni hanno un ruolo molto importante nello sviluppo della vettura perché ci permette di prendere delle decisioni in, tempo, in tempi molto stretti, eh, tempi che sono dettate dalle, eh, dalle competizioni che appunto eh, fra una gara e l'altra abbiamo poco tempo per intervenire e quindi le simulazioni anche già nello sviluppo della vettura ci aiutano a, a, a progredire e a implementare queste soluzioni in vettura. Ad esempio nella Ferrari Challenge ha eh, due eh, settaggi di aerodinamica, uno per, alto carico, eh, per pista ad alto carico di aerodinamica e un altro 
mostrò settaggio per le piste a basso carico aerodinamico e la decisione su una pista magari intermedia su quale andare eh, può influire molto sul risultato finale, cioè quindi se uno sbaglia la scelta è facile eh, finire in mezzo al gruppo e magari giocarsi invece la vittoria se invece indovina la scelta con le simulazioni fatte con eh, ANSYS. The Ferrari Challenge remains a valuable form of research and development. By putting its cars in a single mark head-to-head -head competition, Ferrari is continually gaining precious data to inform the design of future cars. What do you use ANSYS here at uh, Ferrari for? ANSYS uh, helps Ferrari uh, with different solutions in, in sectors like uh, motorsport. There are two important aspects. The first is when we try to explore a new scenario or modify the existing one in order to get a better performance of the car. The second aspect is uh, the ANSYS supports Ferrari with uh, its solution to reduce the time to bring an idea, a new idea on the track up application on one side and uh, thanks to kind of automation that, and collaboration between us uh, that speed up uh, all the process. The reliability of the CFD simulation uh, for the Ferrari Challenge is the, the result uh, of the finely optimized technology balancing uh, on one side uh, the mass resolution of surface and volume and on the other side with addition of computing and costs that sometimes are not necessary for a high mesh density that the high mesh density implies. So how does ANSYS help uh, Ferrari Challenge maintain an edge over the competitors? Having technical partners like uh, ANSYS is the key to find a cutting edge solution uh, using wind tunnel computation for racing cars is expensive, so simulation is an important way to be able to extract uh, aerodynamic ability through CFD simulation. It's, just let me say, is vital now for, for us. I think we got it. It's about reducing time and reducing cost. But it's a whole lot more than that too. Simulation arms competitive racing teams with the data and tools necessary to make quick and informed decisions, sometimes mid-race and maintain that all-important competitive edge in a space where the difference between winning and losing can be measured in milliseconds. Join me next time when our journey continues as we discover innovative companies who are rethinking vehicle and platform designs. I'm Ms. Emma Walsh, and this is Driven by Simulation.